Paul talks about being a slave to Christ. I think that this word, a kyrios, is the word that you would also use to address a master. That, that's just precisely the case. And so when Paul is saying that he's a slave of Christ, I think he's saying he thinks that he's been purchased by Christ and he would use that language. I also think he thinks he's controlled by Christ. I think that because he has the pneuma, he's received the pneuma of Christ, there's the slaveholder's fantasy of the enslaved person as being without a will. But yeah, it, it, it's definitely just simply playing into that language.